Hey, you've reached the cell phone of Kyle Harden. Sorry I'm unavailable. If you leave me a message, I'll call you back. Have a great day. Hey, Kyle, it's Evan. Hey, Kyle, it's Jamie. Hey, Kyle, it's Ed. It's Evelyn. Mr. Harden, this is Barbara. Hey, Kyle, it's Mr. Park. Never heard of you. Hey, Kyle, it's my baby. She's like frozen golf. Hi, I've been here in a couple days. Just making sure. I haven't heard from you in a couple days. I'm just making sure you're all right. I haven't heard from you in a couple days. I'm just making sure you're all right. 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 Hey, Kyle. Hi, you've reached the Harden residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. <laughs> and press three for baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell his diaper. Beep! Okay, okay, stop pressing buttons. This is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave a message... If you're trying to reach... That's right. Baby Jack will call you back, and you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. Yeah, it'll be fun. Talk to you soon. Say command. Call home. Okay. Calling home. Hi, you've reached the Harden residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. And press three for baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell his diaper. Beep. Okay, okay, stop pressing buttons. This is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave a message. If you're trying to reach. <laughs> Right. Baby Jack will call you back, and you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. It'll be fun. Talk to you soon. Say command. Call home. Okay. Calling home. Hi, you've reached the Harden residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. And press three for Baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell his diaper. Beep. <laughs> okay, stop pressing buttons. This is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave a message, if you're trying to reach, that's right. Baby Jack will call you back. <laughs> you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. It'll be fun. Talk to you soon. Oh. 
no. No, 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 no. Those keys do not look very special. <laughs> I know. No, they definitely don't look like they go to something important. Mm-mm-mm. You don't have to say it. Probably just gonna get tossed away in the trash, because what does anybody need with a random pair of keys? I don't have a fucking clue what they go to. Okay. Yeah. I get it. I fucked up. You're so fucking stupid. I bet you didn't even tell Sherry what the keys are for. Of course you did it. Wow. Wow, you are not smart. No. You're unintelligent. Yeah. Uh, a chump. Dolt. Idiot. Halfwit. Ignoramus. Fucktard. How about a knuckle dragger? You're mutton headed. Get out of the car, you fucker. Stupid motherfucker. The inside. Sherry, these are the keys for storage unit 208 at the Uncle Rick storage on North San Fernando Road, City of Eagle Rock. Everything inside is yours. I know you will cherish it. To my sweet Jack. I never knew what happiness was until you. I loved you since you were only a mere twinkle in your mother's eyes. You've given my life meaning in a way I could have never, ever imagined possible. I'm so proud to be your dad. Never a moment passes that I don't think of you. I didn't take advantage of this life the way I should have. I didn't realize this was all we had until it was too late. Life is short. You showed me that. I'm sorry I couldn't change how things worked out. Life throws us curveballs and I didn't know how to adjust. We may not be together, but you are in my heart always and forever. This was not your fault.
Point that thing. Hey. What's 
stop? You drinking? Maybe get some liquid courage since you're being such a fucking pussy. You would be the guy to shoot himself in the face and wind up with that little fucking scratch. Stupid motherfucker. You think you got some gas? Once you close your fucking mouth, go see if that good waxy bourbon's still laying around. Yeah. You remember waxy? So run along now. Go on. Get on, boy. Sorry, ass. Yeah. for horses. Hi, you've reached the heart of residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. And press three for baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell this diaper. <laughs> this is just a regular answering machine. Or answering machine. If you leave a message. If you're to reach. Right. Baby Jack will call you back, and you two can try to decipher what the other said. Talk to you soon. Hi, Sherry. This is Evelyn Mayberry <laughs> from across the street. Didn't I think we may have heard something sound like a gunshot coming from your house? We didn't even think you were all still living there. Check it if everything's all right. Call us back now. What is it, Ed? Why do you keep yammering about it? It was two gunshots and you said it was one. Ed says it was two gunshots that we heard. He's wrong. Call us back anyhow. What do you mean? What the hell do you mean I'm wrong? You're wrong. Two gunshots. Yeah. I hear two gunshots. Uh, I'm not dead, you know. You're wrong. What? 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 Hey, man, what? 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 Horse walks into a bar. The bartender says, Why the big cock? Hi, you reached the Harder residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. And press three for Baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell his diaper. Jeez. <laughs> okay, stop. But this is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave a message, and you're trying to reach. Right. Baby Jack will call you back, and you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. Talk to you soon. Good morning. I'm looking for Harley. Kyle Harden. This is my video from Uncle Ray's story located at San Fernando Road. I'm calling Joe's emergency number. You don't answer other number. Today is finally day for payment before action is for unit number 208. Call back today if you'd like to make a payment. Hello, this is Kyle. Hello, hello. Hello. Mr. Harden? Yes, this is Kyle Harden. It's some kind of mistake. I pay my storage unit every month automatically online. Yes, I see that. The car you have on file declined. Your last payment. Fuck off me! Okay, uh, I can pay it. I just uh, need a couple days. You must pay before the end of the day or unit will go in action. I, well, okay, it's, it's called auction, but... Please, uh, you can't go there. I just told you I'm gonna pay it. I just need a couple days. Si, senor. I understand, but it's the uh, it's in the contract you signed. You cannot go more than seven days late, or we auction everything in the unit. No, you can't auction my shit. It's not legal. I assure you, it's legal. We don't do all the time. It's by, it's by six o'clock, he said. Yes, sir. Uh, what was your name? My name is Madillo. Ask for me. Uh, spell it. M A D E L L E O. Okay. Uh, I'm on my way. Don't sell my shit. Motherfucker. Of all things, man. Of all things to fuck up. <laughs> so fucking stupid. How are you gonna fix this?
kind of freaky, right? It's like we get in a mirror. Only I'm the better version of you. Let's move on from that. Gotta take care of this now. Sherry has to get in that unit, you stupid, stupid man. But you're right. You can't go out there. Look at you. <laughs> I, have you looked at yourself? <laughs> you're a fucking mess. How have you not been arrested? What are the police doing? <laughs> and let's just say you did get to Uncle Rick's. How are you gonna pay it? You're out of money, fuck why? That's why we're having this conversation! Oh, and as you so eloquently put earlier, we got a job to handle. We have a job right to handle. Here. But never fear. I have a plan. Hmm. What's that? You <laughs> could call Evan! <laughs> I could. I could call Evan. No shit, that's why I said it. We haven't talked in a while. Grieving's a process. And what are friends for? Evan's cool, he's gonna understand. Come on, man. He's gotta be cool! Okay. That's good. Fuck yeah, it's good. That's what I'm here for. I like that. Good idea. I'll call Evan. Holy shit, bro. Are you kidding me? There's no way this is. Could it be? Is it Kyle Big Dick Hard On? The one and only. God damn, dude. It's good to hear your voice. How are you? I gotta tell you, Evan. I've had better days. I'm sorry to hear that. I know you know this already, but I'm, I'm here for you. Always have been, always will. Anything you need. That's good to hear. That's very good, because I have a massive favor to ask of you. You need a favor? Okay, I'm down. What's what? What can I do for you? Anything. Anything at all. Well, I ain't gonna suck your cock, though, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, shit. I'll suck your stupid fucking cock already, dude. I said it, so. What is wrong with you? Me? What do you mean, me? You're the one asking for favors. I'm just here to help. Seriously, what can I do? I need you to write down some of the particulars. Hit me. Drive to Uncle Rick's storage in 5544 North San Fernando Road in Eagle Rock. Okay. You have to get there by 6 o'clock today. That's rush hour. Ask for Medillo. What, what? Pay the balance. Oh, uh, Medillo? How do you spell that? I don't know. Hold on. I have it written down. Okay. It's M A D I L L I O. Got it. I, I can head there right now. Is everything all right? Oh, uh, it's complicated, but I don't have any money or any credit cards. And uh, everything in the unit goes to this bullshit auction if I don't take care of it by six today. It's all over like butter on bread. Cool. Let me, I'm gonna actually call you back in a second, but thanks. Hang up on it. Jack? Good morning. Good morning. You, you sound happy today. It's a good day. Sun's out. Soaking in that vitamin D. Cool. Real quick, do you remember Evelyn, our old neighbor? I do remember Evelyn, our old neighbor. And her husband, Ed, was his name. Why? Uh, because she just called me at work and said she thinks she might have heard a gunshot come from her old house. That's weird. Yeah, it is very weird. Elsa found it odd when she told me she saw your car over there this morning. 
Huh. My car? Your car. Uh that that is that that is odd. I I don't know. I, I don't put too much steak sauce on old Evelyn Mayberry. I see. Are you drunk? No! Ugh. Day drinking is stupid and irresponsible. All right, all right, Kyle. I don't have time for your shenanigans right now. I have to go back to work. I just want to know why, for some reason, were you at the house firing guns? I'm running errands. You, I don't do shenanigans, okay? <sighs> I haven't been by the house in a fort's night. Oh, my God. But Give or take a couple forts. I find that hard to believe, yeah. Kyle. I'll tell you what. Evelyn Mayberry is a crazy bat lady. And I'll tell you something else. That old bag of bones husband of hers hip probably shattered. And she thought that was gunshots. So. Are you sure you're not at the house? Kyle. No. No, you're not at the house. You know you're not sure. No. I'm... I'm sure I'm not at the house. Okay, then we go over there to make sure that no one's firing guns. No, why? To make sure everything's okay. Please, for peace of mind, I would go, but you said you were already out. I'm at work. I don't think it's necessary to drive four hours across town because a 80-year-old senile grandma is hearing things. I'm sure everything's all right. Fine, Kyle. You know what? I'm just going to stop what I'm doing. My patients can get their teeth cleaned tomorrow, no, and I'll go oh, over there no, and no, check no, on no, everything. No, 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 don't. You don't need to go over there. I'll uh, Asshole. I'll go over. You you keep doing what you're doing. Kyle's on the case. Okay, great. Thank you. Not a problem. How's your uh, how's your day going? Let me know about the house. Making everyone's teeth extra white. I am hanging up. I love you.
gotta be kidding me. Supposed to call before you show the fucking house. No, 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 Jeannie, no, no, oh. no, we're not showing the house today. Uh, okay, uh -uh. um, hi, Mr. Harden, uh, uh, these are the... Uh... Yes, hi, I don't care. Take them and go away. What are you talking about, Mr. Harden? We had an appointment today uh, at 11 o'clock. Uh -uh. See, these uh -uh. are the barbers. Uh -uh. They no. just want to uh -uh. have no. one last look no. around before no. we... Uh -uh. Do not take another step closer. I, I don't understand what's going on. You don't need to understand. Please leave. No, 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 they're buying your house. You're supposed to call me and tell me when you're bringing people over. That's the deal we had. I did. I called Sherry yesterday. That's Sherry. That's not me. Sh Sherry? I just know Sherry here. You know what? I don't care about anything you're saying. I said don't come in. We're not showing the fucking house whoa, whoa, today. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, buddy. How about you watch your mouth in front of the ladies? Watch Show a little respect. That's right. Watch your language in front of the barbers, okay? And let's just, I just said it, take it down. I just said it five different times. Go away. It's not hard to comprehend. Just leave. Just leave. It's that simple. Please calm down. I am calm. I was calm. I was very calm. And so you came over here with them. You're not listening. You're not listening. And it's very frustrating. What the fuck are you looking at? Get off my property. You can stay, ma'am. Fuck you, sir. How about you don't talk to me that way? Kyle, this is not the way that I conduct my business, okay? I don't okay, care. I am very sorry. You know what? No, it's not your fault that this naked ass was on terror screaming at us. How about you go put some clothes on and mind your manners? You're right. Here, I got you a, uh, it's like a little red Christmas cactus. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Gina, I got you one too. Merry Christmas. Oh my God, I am not going to put up with this kind of behavior. You understand me? I am, I am going to terminate our freedom. Oh, great, great. Whatever you got to do to fucking leave. You know what? I don't even want your bullshit ass house anymore. Fuck you. Fuck me, great. That's your car. Go. I'm out. Bye. I am speechless, Kyle. I have never experienced anything like this in my professional lifetime. Here, here's you. Uh, 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 you need to get some help. Uh, no? You need, no? Uh, yeah! Mayberries! What's up? You like that? Did you tell Jeannie she could show the house today? Yes. You didn't tell me. We were just on the phone like an hour ago. You could have mentioned it. I guess I forgot. You forgot. You forgot. That's real nice. It's real fucking nice. Who cares? It was just the barbers again. Jeannie said they're probably going to put in an offer today. I care. I want to know who's coming over and when they're coming into my house. Our house. <laughs> That's right. OK. Yeah, I forgot that you bought this house with Not your me. money. No, I'm sorry, I just forgot. Well, I'm sorry because that's the way the court sees it, Kyle. Yep, yep, because you sure charm their fucking pants off. <sighs> All right, this is going nowhere. Will you hold on one second? I have another call. Sure, I'll hold on, Sherry. Life's a beach. Life's a fucking beach, huh? I guess you thought it was funny. Kyle. That was Jeannie. Okay. Well, you tell me why you're at the house cussing and screaming at her. I kindly asked her to leave, but that woman does not listen. And I'm sick and tired of you jeopardizing the house. That's bullshit. I don't jeopardize the house. Really? Yeah, really. Then why are you over there?
It wasn't that bad. I don't understand why you care so much if they look at the house today. This could all be behind us. We could move on with our, our lives. lives. You sure say that a lot. Mm -hmm. You'd really like it. To move on, right? We can move on. Jack anymore, right? You don't put him in the past. <laughs> Why would you say that to me? It's hurtful. And when you say that, it hurts. dare you say that to me? That's not fair. You don't get to say that. You left me when I need to. No. Yes. We've been through this, guy. You act like you're the only one to lose him. And you're not. He was both of ours. He was my baby, too.
you've reached the Hardin residence. Press one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. And press three for me. Jackson, press, press four. You'd like to smell this diaper. Beep. <laughs> Okay, stop pressing buttons. This is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave the message, you're trying to leave. Right. Yeah, we'll find back, and you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. It'll be fun. Talk to you soon. Good morning, Mr. Harden. Uh, this is Lee from NPS Collections again. We've tried reaching you for several months now, and you have yet to return our calls and or our mailers. Why? I don't know. This is your final warning that if you don't respond and settle up with your outstanding debt, uh, we'll be forced, forced to take legal action. The amount you currently owe is uh, $84,233.89. We have a few different payment plans, obviously, that I can discuss further with you. Please call me back. Number here is 1-800-SUCK-MY-COCK. Thank you and have a wonderful day killing yourself. Evelyn, sell me out like that. did you think of that? I didn't think of that. Anyway, now you just peacefully fall asleep and you never gotta wake up again. I don't gotta go blowing that handsome face all over the place. <laughs> the pills? No, 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 no. I, I don't do well under heavy influence. I might uh, have a panic attack or something. You hear that? You fucking hear that? That's just bad. That motherfucker goes around and sees your car in the garage they're not going anywhere. There'll probably be more fucking cops. Not to mention, Evelyn is talking to the super cop about you waving your dick all over the fucking place. You had to fuck up the storage unit. Everything was going so perfectly. Our plan was on point. It was on point. But everything's so fucking difficult with you. Nothing is ever simple. That's why Sherry hates you. That's why Sherry hates you. 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 Uh, get them the fuck out of here now! I'm fucking Fuck you! Hey. Uh, Mr. Hardin? Yes, what? What is it? I'm Officer Cox. This is Officer Strawberry. Are you okay? You're out here beating on my door and ringing the bell 18 times asking me if I'm okay? Well, uh, you're bleeding. Pretty badly, sir. It appears. Is that it? No, do you mind if we come in? Oh, I, I do mind, I do mind, actually. Let's take it down here. What can I do for you? Do you have reason to believe a gun was discharged at your house this morning? You have reason? Yes. Is that a question? Yes, sir. Why would you ask it like that? You have reason. It's a statement. Let's just ask it like a normal person. 
Better yet, tell me what your reason is. We received an anonymous tip that Strawberry, a gun... Strawberry, I got this. We received an anonymous tip that a gun was heard going off over here at your house a couple of hours ago. That's right. Also, we were informed that there's an incident with your realtor. Incident? I don't, uh... I don't remember any incidents. An altercation or argument didn't transpire here? You said your name was Cox. Yes, sir. Cox. That's a... It's a weird name on you. you. You don't look like a Cox. There was some uh, shouting heard coming from your residence about 20 minutes after the gun was heard. The realtor was seen leaving distraught. An anonymous tip, you said? That's right. Your tip was mistaken. I don't even own a gun. Is that a fact? Yes. Standing on a broken pot. What's that about? Strawberry, enough. But I'm uh, standing on broken terracotta, sir. You're standing on broken terracotta. I probably wouldn't stand there if it was uh, bothering me. Just step off the broken pieces. <laughs> you two are an uh, interesting, interesting couple. Like, I would never see you and you in the same place and think, those guys must be partners. But it, uh, it works, oddly. Well, that's it, fellas. I'm gonna head back inside. Do you mind if we have a look around the property? I don't care what you do. As long as you're not beating on my door, I'm ringing my doorbell. Woo! <laughs> Talk about a close call. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Great! Where were we? Uh...
What are you doing? You've been looking at me for like the past three minutes. What's up, man? Did you eat a horse tranquilizer or something? <laughs> My God, dude, where did all your hair go? Oh, uh, yeah, I cut it. You gotta leave that to professionals, man. You look like shit. Is that blood? Nah, dude. That ain't blood. It's all over your face. Totally, man. Hey, hold on a sec. I can still, I can still hear you. Okay, so my ETA says I'm about 30 minutes away, but that is impossible, considering I am sitting in a parking lot. Because there's a train carrying empty container wagons. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> yeah. I literally haven't moved in like two minutes. I should just put the car in park. Maybe you should. What did Coach used to say? Don't talk about it. Be about it. I cannot argue with that. Do it. We're all good, man. I put the car in park. We're all green over here. Coach would be proud. Oh, great, of course. Yeah, it just moves five feet now. Uh, oh, no, it stopped again. Okay, we're fine. Oh, my bad, man. Did you want to move up a little bit? Does it five feet get you closer to your destination? Cool. Okay, motherfucker, stop! Dumbass! Oh, yo, I can do that too! I can honk a fucking horn too! You like that? Yeah? Cause your mother did, cause I was honking her horn all night last night, baby! How's she feeling today? Cause when I left her, she was crying! Dickhead! Shut up! <laughs> this fucking guy back here is honking because I won't move up my feet! Oh, I heard. I heard. Okay, okay, you know, shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! I'm gonna handle this guy. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! Fuck! Fuck's wrong with you? Holy shit! Are okay. you kids? I'm sorry. That's right. Back. Okay, take it, take it. I don't want it. Fuck, dude. Fuck. Dude, that shit. guy just ate your burrito. Oh, fuck. Yo, was that your food? <laughs> I can't eat it now. I don't know if he's sick. I don't know what he has. Thing. It's just a tortilla. It's like I'm sitting in a sea of pollution and idiots, man. Yeah, it's that moment you realize your life isn't quite as significant as you thought it was. I mean, there's way too many people. And every last one of them thinks what they're doing is more important than the other guy, yet in the grand scheme of it all, none of it matters. Look at 9-11. Aside from taking two minutes to read your Facebook post about it, one day out of the year, it's like it never happened. And that was just 15 years ago. It, and it, it could be anything, you name it. World wars, tsunamis, earthquakes, starvation. None of it matters to anyone except, and only for a brief moment in time, the people who are directly affected. But for the rest of us, we'll just be... Some sad event that future generations will read about in seventh grade history class, where they're more concerned about if their erection's gonna go away before the bell rings than whatever their fat teacher is saying about 9 fucking 11 anyway. Boners in seventh grade were the shit. Boners in seventh grade were the shit. I remember I used to have to take my backpack and I'd have to swing it around to the front of my pants and hide my boners because they were so big. You know, it's like you only remember when life was good before the bubble burst and the world revealed itself as the shitbox that it is. Yeah, see, that's your problem, though, okay? You need to get back into the bubble. Ignorance is bliss, man. It's simple. No, 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 no. I know way too much of this morbid fucking existence, man. I can't ignore it. Why is, why are you so depressing? Why is this conversation depressing? This whole thing is just, it's depressing me. I'm just being real. I died today. It wouldn't matter. No, it would matter. Because then I would have to go find another best friend to go do favors for. Like sit in traffic. 
So then what was the point to Kyle Harden? From my son. Why was he here? Outside of like a fucking photograph, it's like, he wasn't anything. It's just a memory, you know? like he never existed. So what was the point? What's the point to anything? Or anybody? Get it. Hey, why don't you come out with Stacy and I tonight? Come on. I got a lot to do, you know, we're still trying to sell the house and nope, I'm not taking that, man. stuff I got to take care of. I'll do you one better, buddy. I'm going to come over after the storage unit and I'm going to pick you up and drag you out of that house. Come on. Fine. Yeah? Yes. Yeah! But I got a lot of shit to do, like I said. Okay? So, let me, um, I'm going to call you back. I will be right here. Probably in the same exact spot. Okay. We'll talk in a bit. Hopefully you get there soon. Prescription. You will not be receiving any severance pay. I can you show you the note. Be paying you the remainder of your commission, as those now belong to the company.
歌。Hey. <laughs> uh, so you're all set here. Everything's fine. Everything's paid up. All your belongings are safe and sound. Good, good, good. It's great. Thank you very much. What are best friends for? Yeah, you are my best friend. I never said this because <clears throat> it's like gay or whatever, but. I love you. You're right. That's the gayest thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Adelio, I am so sorry, man. That is horrific. Oh, goodbye. It's nice meeting you. Food truck kimchi. Not good. And I love you too, hard on. Really, I'm glad you called me earlier. You know, you, you seem pretty good, aside from all that depressing shit you were saying earlier. Okay. But all that jabroni stuff, done. Okay? We're moving on. And I'm gonna come over to your house and I'm gonna cheer you up. And when I do, I'm gonna give you one big-ass homoerotic hug. Sweet. I always love those. Yeah. I'm gonna give you one of my <laughs> classic nudges with my penis. Shit, I hope you do. Get up right now. Let's feel it. <laughs> Squeeze me. A little harder. Uh, oh. <laughs> smell nice. You smell like a bathroom. Thank you. I sprayed myself with Febreze. Mm -hmm. That is nice. Do your thing. And I'll be over in about, about an hour. Things will be better on the other side. Yeah. yeah. Hi, you've reached the Harden residence. Press 
one for Kyle. Press two for Sherry. Beep. And press three for baby Jack. Jack says press four if you'd like to smell his diaper. <laughs> okay, stop pressing buttons. This is just a regular answering machine. But if you leave a message, if you're trying to reach. That's right. Baby Jack will call you back, and you two can try to decipher what the other's trying to say. It'll be fine. Talk to you soon. Kyle, Kyle, please pick up. Oh my God, please. I'm on my way over. Kyle, please don't. Mr. Harden, this is the LAPD. Open the door. Mr. Harden, open the door, Mr. Harden, or we'll break it down. Mr. Harden, open the door, please. Knock it down. Mr. Harden? Everything's going to be okay. Don't come in. I have a gun. We're here to help. I don't want any help. I'm here because people care about me. Mr. Harden? Sherry called you, huh? She only wants what's best for you. She's on her way. You can talk to her yourself. Mr. Harden? I need to know that you're okay. I'm fine. Fucking outstanding. Okay. Let me start over, Kyle. Can I call you Kyle? I don't care. My name is Scott. Very nice to meet you. Uh, it's my dad's name. It's a good name. It means painted warrior. If that's not badass, I don't know what is. Is your dad a badass? Yeah. He was. Too badass sometimes. Huh. Tell me about it. I know what you mean. My dad was a real hard ass as well. You know, Kyle, I really hate talking to this door. May I come in alone and we can keep talking? No, this is fine. Stay out there. You stay on the other side of this door. I got a gun point at your fucking head. That hurts my feelings, Kyle. Stop patronizing me! What the fuck? I'm a grown fucking man! I'm sorry, okay? I just want to come in and make sure you're okay and that you don't need any medical attention. I don't need any. You know, I want to believe you, Kyle, but we got reports of gunshots fired at this location, and I really need to see for myself that you're not hurt. Now, I'm going to slowly open the door. Please, don't shoot me. Then don't open the door. I have to, Kyle. That's not OK. I'm coming in. My hands are right here. I just want to be alone, man. I'm unarmed. It's just me. My hands are up. It's just me. I'm unarmed, OK? Kyle, I'm going to leave my hands right here, all right? But you got to do me a favor. Would you mind putting the gun down? Can you just not point it at me, at least? Because I'm not a big fan of having a gun pointed at my head when I'm trying to have a conversation. I don't want to have a conversation with you. Just get out. Nobody's listening to me today. Nobody's listening to me. I am listening, Kyle. That's what I do. I'm here. I'm listening to you. Are you not? <laughs> I asked you to leave, dude. Just get out of my house. I can't do that, Kyle. Sure you can. Walk out the door, man. Walk out the front door. If I were to leave right now and something were to happen to you, I got to go home with that. How am I going to look my son in the eye and tell him I did everything I could to help you, huh? I'm here, Kyle. Look at me, Kyle. Look at me. I'm here. I care 
about what happens to you. A lot of people care. What you do here has a lasting effect on a lot of people. Okay? So just put the gun down. You don't want your son to see you like this. You don't talk about my son. <laughs> Whoa, 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 easy. He doesn't want me in the room, okay? Just stand down. Back up. We're cool. We're cool, right, Kyle? I'm backing up. Backing up. I got a clear shot! <laughs> what are you gonna do? <laughs> shoot me? You gonna fucking shoot me? Shoot me. Please. I'm having a real fucking hard time doing it! Easy, Kyle, just stand down! I've Kyle, got to get you! I've got to get the fuck out of my house! Kyle, 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 Yeah. <laughs>